Hey guys, I'm back with another video. So I just want to say I'm sorry for not making any videos recently. I've just been really busy on uh, editing the video I'm actually making right now. Um, the reason why it's taken so long is just because I want everything to be tip top perfect. Um, since this video is, since that video will be a big day, big deal. Um, and I want everybody to understand where I'm coming from with it. Um, so that's why it's taking forever. Um, but I hope everybody had a good Thanksgiving. And uh, I wonder how, how many of you guys actually went Black Friday shopping. I know I did yesterday. Wasn't really expecting to go Black Friday shopping, but it was kind of like a last minute deal at um, 8 o'clock. So we just, Rachel and I just went. Um, and also, um, as I'm waiting for my mechanic to get back to me so we can get the Celica GT build going, um, I bought a daily. So I like this daily. Um, I know it's not perfect. It's a lot of rust and little small problems, but it was super cheap. I think it was like, I paid only $500 for it. He was uh, originally asking for a uh, thousand, and I talked him down to five hundred. Um, so I bought this cheap daily. Um, I know she doesn't look the best, and like I said, she has some small problems. But hey, not—it's not like I can add a little love and tender and care to it and make her look good again. So, um, so I'm pretty excited to show you guys. I hope you guys uh, like this new daily. Um, and once I get the Celica GT up and running and the project is completely done what I, on what I have in mind, and then I'm going to start working on this daily and hopefully we can make this daily look pretty mint. So we'll, we'll see you guys outside. Oh, it's just a wonderful day to go cruising actually. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go to the uh, car wash and uh, give her a little clean up. And I'll show you guys what my, duty, my new daily is. So we'll see at the So car. this is what I got. This is my new daily. It's a 94 Honda Del Sol. It's a 1.5 5 speed manual transmission. I mean, yeah, it doesn't look good. You got the rust. There's some rust on there, you know. It's, I, I expect that. You know, we're, we're well known for having rust on cars, you know, just, yeah, she don't look that pretty, but once I'm done with her, she will. Hope you guys enjoy it. I mean, kind of another reason why I got it is because it kind of reminds me of the 6th Gen Celica's. But more me, uh, more Honda. Um, so yeah, there's a dent right there. Need to get a new fender, get a new door. And I'm gonna do. I'm gonna cut all this out and then re refab it out. Since I know how to weld, I'll probably probably weld it out. Yeah, cut it out. Weld some uh, sheet metal, do some body work, paint it, make it look white again, you know. Just clean it all up, you know. So, and the only issues that's wrong with it is the door handles don't work. So I had to put my hand inside and then open the door that way, which that's an easy fix. And then also the clutch and the throw out bearing needs to be replaced, which that's about a $50 fix. So I'm not too worried. But other than that, she's a nice car. We'll make her look good again. And also, should I do the teeth on these? You know, since my cars are pretty famous for having their the the sharp teeth, should I add the 
teeth right there and then wrap the uh, these fog lights because these are the, the fog lights should I wrap those with the, my famous wrap too let me know what you guys want what do you guys want to see done to it now I know this is my car it's my project but uh it's good to know what what you guys seem to fit I want to stance it out like lower it and then add some nice wheels and then keep the body clean and you know I don't know I'm still trying to think on what I want to do to it. But yeah, she, she's not a bad car. Everything works. All windows. Aftermarket uh, speakers. So. What do you guys think? The new daily. Now, as far as I know, this is not uh, VTEC. The 95s come with VTEC. So. Um, and since I have a buddy who is really good with Hondas, I think I might just do an engine swap with like a turbo VTEC or something. I don't know. I'll, I'll keep you guys updated, but let me know what you guys think of this new Del Sol. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, about to go run a couple errands I'll bring you guys with and kind of dink around with it. So we'll see you guys I really in the I really hope this, this fits. Um, but what I like about this Del Sol is it's very short, just like a Miata. Now, if you guys haven't seen my Miata video, please check it out. I really, really enjoy Miatas. Now, the reason why I like Miatas so much is just because they're small cars. Easy, the lightweight, and you can zip around with them, and just it's never a dull moment with the Miata. I would, um, now, same thing with this Del Sol. Yes, it's only a front wheel. Now, only downfall is that it's a front wheel drive car. as much fun as you would with a Miata, but this car is still just as good. Um, this car is as lightweight as a Miata, front wheel drive. It's fun little zippy round to drive around town, very good um, gas. I think it only cost me less than 20 bucks to fill it up, and that's all we from empty to full. Um, so I can't honestly can't wait to see what um, what, I, what my plans are for this car. Now I'm feeling like a monster truck right now because on how how tall this this car is. It's still on stock suspension so I guess that means that uh, it's time to get some coilovers and lower this baby um, you know like I said she ain't the prettiest looking thing but when she wants to go she will go she will zip around corners like it's like it's made to do it now, I'm going to call this the, the poor man Miata. You know, alright, well, my, uh, my uh, camera died, so I had to hurry up and plug it in. So, I remember what I was saying. Now, if you hear that noise, that is the clutch and the uh, throw out bearing that's what's causing the really loud, disgusting sound and uh, like I said that was the, the $50 $60 fix so I'm not really worried about it it will get fixed before winter time hopefully Go to uh, Ace 
nice hardware just to see what they have um, there. Just to look around. So it's been pretty much months and months and months since I've, since I've had a car. So just kind of driving around, having fun in this thing. I love driving manual cars. It's definitely a lot better than driving automatics, in my opinion. So here I am at um, Ace Hardware. I'll bring you guys in and kind of look around, get some ideas or something. All right. We'll All see right, you guys so I wasn't going to Ace Hardware, but Rachel called me. So I guess my plans have changed. So I will be going into Ace Hardware some other day, and I'll bring you guys in just to look around. Um, but Rachel said that she has a special surprise for me. Um, I'm guessing it's going to be an early birthday present, just because my birthday is next week. It would be Tuesday, November. Uh, would be November 28th. Um, so pretty excited for my birthday. I'll be uh, 24 this year, and. Yeah, pretty excited. So, plans have changed, but this is all right. No biggie. Um, so, yeah, let me know what you guys think of this Del Sol. Um, I definitely enjoy this car. It's nice little fast thing. Um, not boosted or anything, but it's all right. It's just a simple car that gets me from A to B, um, plus wherever I want to go. Um, let me know what you guys think of this. I know it um, has some rust. I plan on taking care of it. Uh, I want to bring it back. I want to bring this car back to its prime and uh, making it look really nice. So I hope you guys will uh, keep updated with the Del Sol project and also with the Celica project. So I got a couple good, good news. I have a couple sponsorships that reached out to me and that would love to sponsor my channel. But they said the only thing that's stopping them from doing that is my subscribers. Um, I'm at 62, which I'm very thankful for you guys. And I'm, it's, it's awesome to see my channel build. Like I've been saying, it's really nice. And I uh, appreciate you guys taking the time out of you guys today to um, watch my videos. And I appreciate that. But they're wanting me to hit over a thousand subs in order to to sponsor my channel so we can get some new car gear coming in I'm not gonna say quite yet because I really don't want to ruin the future videos but uh, from what my sponsor and I were talking about we're gonna see some pretty sweet shit um, and I'm very very excited that they reached out to me and um, I'm, just, <laughs> I'm just excited ah oh, um, you know I've had three sponsorships uh, notify me within the, within October and the beginning of November, so I'm pretty excited for that. Um, I'm I'm kind of curious on to see what they have in store for me. So, if you guys can help me get to a thousand subs or more, you know, so I can get my sponsorship going and start um, get the ball rolling, I really appreciate that. Um, and so, yeah, that is it for today, guys. I really appreciate you guys watching this video. Um, if you guys like this video, don't forget to hit that, uh, don't forget to smash that like button for me. Um, and leave some good vibe video, uh, comments down in this video. Um, and let me know what you guys think. So thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll definitely see you guys next time.